Welcome to Data Doctor's video, Gender, Mr. E or Miss Take. Gender, there doesn't seem to be much to discuss, except here, where we deal with records or lack thereof. It's not always clear, due to omission or mistakes or bad handwriting. Women are marked as males and men as females as has happened to Mr. E's profile recently. He's worried he'll have to give birth to his, er, her children, since he's a woman now. But let's get back to the video. What if no gender is specified at all on a profile? How do we tell then? Often by their first name. When a WikiTree profile for someone named Alfred is marked as female, or Edith is marked as male, we start to wonder, is that right? It certainly triggers a gender suggestion. Statistics can be a useful tool, and here on Wikitree Plus, that tool is available for genealogists of all experience and interest levels. When suggestions from the gender group appear, such as for Brian here, Click on his first name from that report. An analysis shows you the statistical percentages of Brian being a male or female. My French Canadian ancestors often named their children Joseph Marie and Marie Joseph. Here is the analysis of those two names together, showing which are males and females. And what if their first name is unique, Toby? Doriel, Lorend. That's when research comes into play. Look at their relatives and their relatives' records. Good places to start are census records, obituaries, and wills, where family members are named in a group. Sometimes a unique name is accompanied by a more familiar name, and you can search for both at the same time. For instance, here is an analysis of the name Almana Jane, with no gender indicated. There is also only one Almana on Wikitree, again with no gender specified. The analysis of all the Janes on Wikitree indicate a strong likelihood that the profile is of a female. Most of the time, the gender question can be resolved, but there are exceptions. Unnamed stillborn infants are one. Without documentation, we'll never know, and a gender suggestion should be marked false. A research notes heading should be added to the profile, explaining the lack of gender. As for Mr. E, he'd really appreciate someone setting his record straight. He admits he makes one ugly woman You are invited to like this video and even leave a comment if you wish. Also, keep up to date with new videos by subscribing to our Wikitree YouTube channel. On behalf of the Data Doctors Project, thank you for watching.